Hey guys. It's working. The microphone is working. The music. I think you will hear it. So another indie game review um, that I promised another person that I will play. Uh, so I'm going to do it today. So why do I have this menu? Okay, there's, there it is. So this game, I'm going to put it right here because it's something else I have to do. Okay, I have to hear the game. This is the song I put. The same composer always puts uh, Peter Grundy. And now um, I'm going to come here to Kephan. I hope I say that right. Uh, he played my game too, um, and I promised him I will play the game also because this is about Mars. Uh, I think I know the the book that uh, came a couple of years ago, uh, the Martin, and I loved it. So I was like, okay, I'm, you know, I have that like the same color, that orange, and I have the same color too. <laughs> so I was like, hey, I'm gonna play this game. Um, so I went to Ichio, I have here, I'm gonna put um, the links in so you can follow him, you can actually go and see what he does, like he, now he's doing something else I think, you know, I think he loves orange a lot, like the yellow orange kind of thing, but you can actually, you know, Watch his Twitter and then we go to Ichio, you have and his page. Uh, and then when you come to the game, it looks really nice. I'm gonna zoom in. My internet works. Uh, I cannot stream today. I wanted to stream and show my game, and I was like, ha ha ha. And then OBS was like, no, your, your internet is really low. It's not gonna work. And I'm like, oh my. I couldn't. So this is the, the picture. It's really nice. I wanted to do that too in my game with this grain effect. Uh, but it works more better in his game. Maybe because he's like another different planet and all. Oh, that's really cool. Okay. I didn't watch the, the pictures that much. Yeah, it's really nice. I'm curious, would it be like the same like in the, the book, the, the Martin book, or would it be a little bit different? I don't know what uh, what his inspiration is. So, I am in the right place on the surface of Mars, but the way I came down here is all but right. At least I'm in one piece. My space suit seems to be intact as well but the pot i better check it out so if i can find the emergency beacon yeah that's a bit the same like the i think every every movie or book about this is the same thing right uh man of mars is a first person exploration game set on the surface of mars find out what happened to you search for the emergency beacons Turn them on and escape the unforgiving planet you were supposed to land on in the first place, but not the way you did. Okay. Good. You have here the development logs and all the comments. Okay. And then I'm going to rate it. I'm going to put this also on the, the description so you can try it out. Because it's really nice to try it out, you know. I did the same thing with... Um, uh, with Assassin's Creed, I was like, I, I watched someone play the game and then I said like, after 20 minutes, I was like, oh no, I'm not gonna watch it, the whole the whole gameplay, I'm gonna buy it and play it. And it's with, uh, it was Assassin's Creed 2 with Ezio Aditore di Ferenze, he's my favorite. Uh, the second will be Connor and the third will be, I think Cassandra, because I like the Greek uh, Greece is a nice country, and uh, Greek mythology, I love it a lot. And um, yeah, and orange, or, uh, Origins too, but I like the, the pyramids and all this thing, but the story didn't 
didn't took my heart that much. But with Cassandra, I did the whole map. I think I had 100% on PlayStation for that game, so I did a lot. So I'm gonna stop this music. If you want to like listen, it's Voleur, and it's from Peter. You can see Peter Grungy. If you wanted to listen, it's a Viking songs. I really like Viking songs now because from because of Bahala. I'm like a God of War was a really nice game about Nord mythology, and then when I saw from Hala and I loved music, then I saw this album, and I'm just listening so much about it. So, hey, I'm like blah 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 blah, but I'm not starting it. Hey, let's do this. I hope this will be nice. God, today is really warm again. I think it would be like 36 again or 38 degrees. Yes, yes, run. It's 12.19 now. Clock, I mean. So it's hot. I am in the right place on the surface of Mars. But the way I came down here is all but right. At least I'm in one piece. My spacesuit seems to be intact as well. But the pod, I'd better check it out and see if I can find the emergency beacon. That something? Oh, <laughs> it's like <laughs> I had that same thing to to look up, and I thought I had to wait. Wow, this looks really nice. Just gonna try to go really slow. Wow, with the misting, that's look really good. And then, yeah, and then the lens flare, that's good. Smoke, wow, it looks really good. Okay, so I have to go, oh, I can't do it with this too. I always do, like when I walk, like when I was little, I did the same thing. You do the, the arrows on your laptop or on your keyboard, I always do. I don't do it with the W, V, and S and all these things. So, oh, yeah, yeah. The beacon functions. There should be three more pods out there. They won't have any astronauts on them. Everyone else died in the freak fire, but the pods mm -hmm. must have beacons. If I manage to turn them all on, I can establish more coordinates and send for help. After all, our sister ship and meant to be right home still on orbit and can land a port to pick me up. So I better get going. Damn. That would be a worse experience to landing on Mars or on other planets and just everybody dies and you'll be like the only one. Or like my game was different. I didn't know from this one, but from Mine was worse. I was like, you cannot wake up someone if they, if you need help, yeah, you know, and they are like a speci specialized, uh, how you say, that they're, they're known to be like an engineer or something or mechanic and they, they have to help you. Yeah, you can wake them up, you know, that, but no one knew to repair the ship. And I was like, fuck, I'm alone. <laughs> I cannot repair the ship. So I, Think of the worst thing. Very really nice song too. We really love it. The colors are, are really nice and it's really calming on the eyes. That's really important. That it's not like you, you play like this. It's like a really nice... I really love it. The colors match perfectly. The song is nice. I don't know if I have to run or is that the other shift? Like, yeah, it's the other shift. <laughs> I did the shift from the right one. So he said, "With the rover, its battery light is on, but otherwise it's completely broken." And an emergency beacon is nowhere to be seen. Hopefully it can be found somewhere nearby. I think I saw something there. 
I'm not used to shift with the left one. Why is this? I'm not going to do that. I don't know. I'm just roaming around. I don't mind actually to take my time. I like this song so much. That helps a lot. You know when you you uh, play a game and a song is really nice. Especially with Witcher. My god, I loved all the music, all the songs and I think I was like really crazy about Witcher. A lot. Is that like rocks or oh, yeah. That was something else. Okay, my mistake, my mistake. I wonder how big it is, the, the map. Okay, where we go? Left, right. Ini mini mat pim pam put ini mini as as the van man the man the man the zain man the man the build the claim. Okay, we go there. <laughs> it's a long time I did that. <laughs> I see another smoke, so it's a good sign. I like that whisper thing. It's like it's in your head, you know, it's like, you don't hear it? It's because of the song, I think. Or there's another effect, you never know. Okay. I have to hold this. The shift. I really like how he did the terrain thing. Really good. Another one! I found two beacons. After Yay! finding two more, I had my coordinates established. So, I don't know why everybody choose Mars. Like, why don't they choose like Jupiter or something? Or something like really different. Oh, that would be nice in Jup uh, Jupiter. That would be like a lot of storms. I think it's a lot of storms on it, right? The set of ones. So, where are we going now? This is not easy, you know, like, do I have to go down or do I have to go up or... It's like in a, a real life thing, you know? I don't know where to go. And I'm alone. That'd be really awful to be alone. God damn. I think it would be hot too. <laughs> I think it would be more hotter, hotter than here. I don't know where I go, but I'm walking on the sands. Don't judge me. I don't know where I'm going. A lot of people will say, well, why don't you go on the left or the right? Is that the same thing that I did at the beginning or am I... Like, I don't know. I don't know. This is so, like confusing you know if you're in a desert or in the ocean or in the woods and then you, you just walk and it's like all the same it's like where am i like i'm lost i think i was here yeah i remember the rocks there but i'm not sure i think so where is it i think it i think mm -hmm. i don't know i'm gonna go there it's really confusing I can remember uh, my game was with the this, with this flare thingy and it was a, a, an orange one and it's like helping people to kind of come confused and lost. But here it's like, ah, where is it? Yeah, I did that one too. I think I have to go down or, or where. 
I don't know where to go. I think I have to, I have to go down. Bro, where is it? <laughs> where is the second one? I don't see the smoke, but maybe, you know, maybe we like, maybe you see the smoke when you get closer. I don't know. Normally I play games always with uh, quests and things like that, so. But I don't know where to go. I think I have to go down. Because it's like, a, can I go down? We go down. I think it's down. We already were up and I didn't see anything. Damn. Don't say I'm like crashing the game now. Roxana, you didn't have to go there. I'm sorry. Okay, I didn't know where to go. And if I had to, well, I'm happy. <laughs> I like the color. You have here the dark orange, then you have the light orange, then you have the white. Beige kind of whitey, and then the blue. Really nice. It's too bad you cannot find like aliens on it. The like, game, bro. Do you know the next beacon? They give you a ride. Vroom, vroom, vroom. I know that like, a star in the Star Wars would be nice. I think I did that one, didn't I? Didn't I do that? If I'm not doing correctly, I will have a, 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 another digital slap on my face. I don't know where to go. I don't know where to go. And I don't see where it is. But I'm roaming on Mars. And it's boring as hell. I really am curious if you want to live in Mars. Would that be like... an amazing planet to live? I was like... It's not, not that interesting. You know what I'm saying? I get really impatient now. <laughs> I want to take the third beacon! Where's the third beacon? Please, where is it? <laughs> and Roxana, how, how does it take to, to, to finish this game? It took me three hours <laughs> to find the third beacon. Where the hell was it? <laughs> I didn't I didn't play a game because I don't find a beacon. God damn it. I have to go up, am I? I don't mind to walk, you know, the song the song is really nice, so I like to walk and have nice music um to listen. But I'm really am curious where to go now. We already did that, yeah. So where is it? There was one there. The other one was not. And this one it is. Hmm. Let's go faster. I am crashing the game. Oop. I like that smoke. That mist, I really love that mist a lot. Do, do, do. I got if you're like in panic mode and you crash and everybody dies, I don't think you would like walk really nice like, oh that's gonna take a walk. You know. Okay, I don't know where to go. I'm confused. I'm going up. I'm going up, 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 up a way to go. Up, 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 up. If I crush the game, I'm going to kill myself. Ah. Ah. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
ignore me. If I do really silly voices, I always do that. And uh, it's weird. So where is it? Don't say it's there. Don't say it's there. Because I don't know. I don't know where it is. Okay, this is really not easy to find it. Oh, 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 whoa, 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 there are two of them. I know because the third one was no beacon. So I have to find it here with the, where the rocks were? Hmm. I have to go back because there was like nothing. There was nothing to be seen and I have to go back. I think it's in between the rocks. I have to look. Don't judge me. <laughs> A lot of people will be like, do you see it? <laughs> no, I don't see it. I don't see it. I'm mean, already like finished though. I don't know what's going to happen with the beacon. Like, damn, that sound, man. So where is it? It has to be somewhere here then. Hey, beacon, 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 beacon. <laughs> hey, beacon, beacon, beacon. Where the heck are you? Where the heck are you? I'm getting crazy. Getting crazy and crazy and don't see it. I don't see it on the floor or on the sand. And what the hell? Where is it? It'll take three hours when I find it. How was your day today? Well, I tried to find a beacon, but I didn't. I couldn't. That was that. If that's a rock, then damn me. God damn it. No. It's not a beacon. What is it? I really want to know what happened after I did the beacons. Like, I know he said here that it's, it's not here. And the drone is dead. Okay, let's... Let's go to the rocks there. I am impatient and I cannot stand it. Oh my god, I remember that in World of Warcraft in the beginning of the game. We had like the quest, you had to read it, and then we were you, you always had to do it with your friends, you know, and then we're like north west behind camp or something and I was like oh, where is it <laughs> I don't see it my friends were like reading me too like yeah I don't I don't know where that is and we got lost and then sometimes it was like a tunnel or something of a cave and I was like oh, really this is damn bullshit you know what I don't know where to go Are you kidding me right now? What? Was it there the whole time or was that the second beacon that I did? Because I'm like lost. No, this is new. God damn it. Am I like uh, circling or not? Because I don't think so. <laughs> hey, it's warm here, okay? I can't be like lost <laughs> from the warmth. Please, I want you to be there. Oh my God, I'm so happy I found it. How, mu how much took it took? Where is my uh, 27 minutes? Okay, <laughs> it would be so awful being like an hour. Like, Roxana, I'm disappointed. 
I'm disappointed. It's not the first one, right? Ah, oh, no, 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 no. It's not. Where's the beacon? Oh, give me the beacon. That's a third beacon. This day doesn't look so bleak anymore. And now? And now? What do we have to do now? He said that we had to do the beacons, right? Or there are four beacons. Like, damn, man. Danger. It's a very nice piece of thing. I'm so... Where do we go? Where do we go? Am I going like slow or was something wrong with me? Okay. Um I don't know. Is there is there four beacons? I heard there was three. I am a really, really big like a really biggest idiot ever. I never, like, if there is a quest or you need to do a mission, you have to write it down. And I, when I just listen, I'm like, what, what did he say? Like, I don't, I don't keep it up like really good. So I, I thought it was only three. So I don't know what I have to do. I have to go back. Or do I have to go somewhere else? I told you I'm an idiot. <laughs> I don't know where to go. I did it once, I did it twice. Boop, 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 boop. Let's go here and let me see. I see another one. I think it's four beacons. But I'm not sure if that is a new one or an oldy one. Hmm. Let's go, let's go. I don't see it. Oh no, it's all here. Ah, I'm sliding. Uh, whoop. Ah, I don't see anything. I really used to. I'm, I'm used to with consoles. I'm not used to with uh, the mouse and the keyboard. It's a long time I played that. I think since 15. I uh, played a computer and then I had a laptop or something. I don't know. I don't remember anymore. Jesus. I don't even remember when I got my PlayStation 3, and it's not a long time ago. I did one of this, why? Or was a new one? No, I did this. What do I have to do now? I'm not gonna finish this game, I'm die. So what do I have to do? Like I have to grab something or do I have to go back? I think I have to go back. I'm gonna try, go back. Then I will say to him like, hey, how do you finish the game? Like, I was wandering around, I'm gonna ask, you know, yeah, I don't know, like, there was a game that I played on Itch.io, it was a monster, like, it's not a monster, but it was an animal, alien kind of thing, but it was really beautiful, and it had, like, a really nice horns. So, when you press a button on the console, the left one, you can grow plants. 
and you press the right one, that uh, makes the plants, how you say, not grow. Like they will like dissolve. They will just no. And I was like, "Whoa, this is like a really good ide idea." So. Yeah, I love that. I couldn't finish it because I was like, what should I do now? And uh, I told him, I was like, uh, or her, I don't know who the, I don't know if it's a she or a he. And I said, I couldn't finish the game. I really want to. And I asked. So I'm going to try it again just to finish it. I don't know if I have to go back. That's a problem. I. I don't know, I'm really bad in this to listen and then it's like, what do I have to do? If you have like, re uh, you have to read it, I get, like I have a good memory if I read something. If I have to listen, it's not enough. It's the same thing at school, you know, when the professor is just talking, 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 and then you know that whole story, just one piece is parts and I just write it down and then it's in my head, so everybody's different. So I hope that I had to go back. So what should I do now? No, I don't have to go back. Like, I don't know what the hell I have to do now. I don't know what to do now. I have to go to the drone and back or... I have to do this again, aren't I? Yeah, I think I will do this again. Listen what he's saying. Because I don't know what I have to do. I'm in, I'm in Mars. I don't know what to do here. I think it's four. And it is one... <laughs> of... A one... Uh beacon here that I don't find at all. I don't know. I'm lost. Now I feel really lost. I don't know what the hell I have, I have to do. I have to go back and play this game again and then record the last piece of it because what's there? If it's a rock, I'm going to be really mad. What is it? Oh fucking hell. You were here. Are you kidding me? I thought it was like right here in the middle. Oh god damn it. It's All the four. beacons have been found and turned on. <gasps> the ship has now my location and an emergency board will land soon in the vicinity. Are you kidding me? Where is it? Where is the ship? So... How do I know the right... He knows my location. Is it in the middle? No, because we have this one, and then it's this, and it goes there. No, Roxana, it's not Christmas yet. No, no, stop. So what the hell? Where I have to go now? Like, where's the ship? You know where it is. Okay, okay, that's fine, but... Um, do I have to go back there? I, I don't know where the ship... God damn it. I think that uh, it's really useful if they use um, lights above, like, of, 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 of goddamn beacon. Because I don't know where to go. I don't think I have to go back. I don't know. I don't know where the ship is because I heard something. So? No. So we're gonna walk around again. <laughs> I don't hate the game, but 
I'm a person that doesn't have a lot of patience and there has to be a lot of action or something, you know? And it's just like, uh, the fucking Mars. It's, it's really boring. I now I understand uh, the Martin when he was like really, really, really desperate and really depressing. He is a Mars eating his raw potatoes, you know. Uh, I think in his, in his, um, I would say that, where he lived, I don't think it was raw, but when he had to take the rover and he had to go on a long distance to the satellite, I was like, oh damn, he has to eat the raw potato to survive. Damn. That was really bad. And uh, something happened with the rover, wasn't that? It's a long time and I really read it. It was like really boring and like when he explained Mars, he tried to make a funny, like a joke about it, but it was like, no, that was really bad. So what do I have to do now? <sighs> Where's the ship? Where is the ship? Because he said, like, they know my my signal now, my... <gasps> oh, fucking hell, I'm so happy. There's a light. Oh my god, I'm fucking... Now I now I feel the, like the Martian. I feel that you can survive! Oh my god, that really made me happy. Th this, this light made me happy. I was like, oh my god. This is so cool. I'm gonna go home or to another planet. I don't care. Being like, honey, we're not going to the beach. Why? I, I think I have enough with sand. <laughs> Let's go to the forest. <laughs> Yay! That's really cool. Be continuing. Going away. Can we? Oh, yeah, that's. that's it. I'm saved, but this trip shore was a catastrophe. Tuh. First a freak accident on board of the spaceship that killed everyone else save me. Then a short walk on the surface of a planet no one's feet had touched before, and now a hasty retreat. This is not how the first moon landing went. Okay, no. Actually, no. Oh, I did that too. I'm gonna make a... Ah, it says boy, so yeah. Special thanks to David, well, that's really cute. I did that too. Well, I was like feeling really desperate and really, like, we really lost. I'm gonna close this. Um, I felt really lost, and <laughs> like in the end, I was like, oh no. We're not going to find a beacon. It was like in real life, you know, um, that you don't know where to look, and it's it's hard. So it's not easy. Um, let me look at it. I'm gonna put it right here. Yeah, I th I really liked it. I really liked, it. and then when I saw the lights, yeah, just like here in the page, I was so happy. I was like, oh my god, I don't have to walk and find that. No, I really liked it. It was like, uh, in the beginning you're like excited and then you start to be irritated and then you lose hope and then you actually feel that hope again, you know, like, <gasps> like we're saved. No, I really liked it. I liked it. I'm gonna read this. So I'm gonna give a five. Because uh, I, I remember, like, I liked this, this little game, but um, yeah, it's great. Okay, uh, we're gonna do the animals. We're gonna go to here, and then we're gonna go to interact. Uh, 
I feel bad that he didn't like mine. <laughs> and I was like, it's real. I was like, oh no. So it's not me. Oh yeah, look at it. 18 hours ago. I didn't know that. I don't have here. Oops. But he didn't like my game and I was like, no. I like his. It was really nice. It was like the Martin. Uh, I liked. I cannot write because I'm now like. I liked your game. It's just like the Martin book. Or actually, the Martin book. Yeah, I'm gonna say Martin book. I want to say story. Uh, the colors are very nice. And I started to. To why am I not seeing? I started to feel in the beginning really excited. If I write this wrong, then I'm fuck it. Excited. I think I write it wrong. Uh, excited and by walking around, I felt irritated and lost and then when and then when then when I found all the beacons and the bright lights I was so happy to make a game in with a lot of mixed uh, emotions isn't that easy. So great job. It's true, you know. Uh, it's really true that a game to have all of these emotions and a short time. It's really not that easy. So uh, I'm going to submit this and I'm going to close it. And I really liked it. Really good. So I'm going to put this uh, on the YouTube and Twitter. And that's it. Well, that's just uh, 45 minutes. Not bad. But with the talking in the beginning. So I think a half hour was the game. If you take your time, but uh, no, I really liked it. I really like the orange color, like the red orange. That uh, that's why I like the Martin because I like the cover so much, and it's also the same colors. And I was like, you know, the, the colors really it's really important, even on books of uh, images too. So, no, I love it. Really good. Keep making games. I think I'm following you. Yeah, yeah, I'm following you. So good, good. I'm gonna continue my game now <laughs> without streaming. So uh, I hope I can finish my goddamn town. I think I have an idea, but uh, I need really good music to blow my mind. So uh, yeah, thank you for watching. Thank you for the game too. If you play this game, you just write in the comments. Uh, if you liked it, if you have an opinion, it helps a lot. And um, yeah, that's really it. So if you know a game that I want to, you know, say like, hey, Roxanne, you want to play my game? Just send me, I will do that. No problem. Okay. Have a nice day. Have a nice summer. God damn, it's hot. Um, yeah. Have fun. Bye.